As the visitor leaves the city and moves further inland, another world unfolds, a more ancestral Africa, a more mysterious realm. The savanna extends as far as the eye can see. Some of Africa's most beautiful natural parks with their countless species of animals are found here. Far from the coast, where three quarters of Senegal's population lives, the savanna offers more difficult living conditions. Many of the inhabitants eke out a living by farming, and many possess only the most basic of tools. A plentiful rainfall during the growing season is vital for bringing in a good harvest. The inhabitants of this region grow crops in function of their own needs and do not always have a surplus to sell at market. Retba Lake is one of this country's natural curiosities. Located 60 kilometers north of Dakar, this small lake turns a pinkish color in daylight. On cloudy days, the water appears gray. Its variation in color is due to a kind of algae which lives in the lake's salty water. It's the diffraction of the sunlight which gives this lake a pinkish glow. Seeing the men walk across the middle of the lake is an astonishing sight. In fact, they're walking on a crust of salt which has been formed approximately five feet below the lake's surface. The crust is the result of a large quantity of salt which remains and solidifies after the water evaporates. The unique makeup of this lake provides the locals with an unusual way to earn their living. 